Hello everyone, this is Shraddha Burai from IPS TV Vendor. Today we will discuss the convergence order of secant method. We have seen many iterative methods um, like bisection method, false position method and Newton Raphson method. A serious disadvantage of Newton Raphson is the need to calculate the differentiation of function. In many situations, this differentiation of function is very long. So, we have to use such method in which we don't need to calculate the differentiation of function. So in secant method, uh, we'll use this iterative formula for our computation. Uh, that is xi plus 1 equals to xi plus 1 into f of xi minus xi into f of xi minus 1 upon f of xi minus f of xi minus 1. So first of all, let's suppose y be our root and um, of f of x equals to 0 so and our error in ith iteration is ei in i plus 1th iteration is ei plus 1 and in i minus 1th iteration is ei so by this we can obtain our ei plus 1 equals to xi plus 1 minus y here xi plus 1 is our assumed uh, assumed root and y is our actual root and expanding f of xi and f of xi minus 1 by Taylor series, we have uh, found this type of expression. This is the f of y plus ei f dash y plus ei square upon 2 f double dash y. This is the uh, f of xi. Uh, this is the expanded form of f of xi by Taylor series. And by this, we have the error term in i plus 1 at iteration as ei minus 1 into ei square minus ei into ei minus 1 square upon 2 into ei minus ei minus 1 into f dash y and our reduced form of this error term in i plus 1 at iteration is given by ei into ei minus 1 into f double dash y upon 2 into f dash y so first of all, when we need to calculate uh, the i plus uh, i plus uh, error in i plus one iteration, uh, so first of all, uh, yeah, it is necessary to find the formula of type e i plus one equals to k into e i m. Here m is uh, order of convergence, uh, which we will need to calculate. M is our order of convergence of secant method. So for this, first we have uh, this type of expression that is ei equals to k into ei minus 1 m uh, by this uh, expression we have obtained this so and our ei minus 1 by this expression is going to be ei upon k whole to the power my 1 by m now substituting this value uh, in equation uh, sorry in equation 2 that is in this equation We will get error in i plus 1th iteration as ei into ei to the power 1 by m. That is ei to the power 1 plus 1 by m into this expression. And this expression uh, will going to be our k value for k. Now comparing equation third and equation 1. Equation 1 is this. We will have... Uh, k value uh, this is k value and e plus ei plus 1 is equals to k into ei to the power m by the by eliminating k we have this type of expression that is ei to the power m equals to ei to the power 1 plus 1 by m so now uh, comparing the powers that is m equals to 1 plus 1 by m we have obtained one quadratic that is m equals to 1 plus 1 by m or we have this type of quadratic m square minus m minus 1. Now when we calculate our m that is order of convergence by this quadratic we have found the value 1.6180 thus the order of convergence of secant method is 1.6180 which is less than the convergence order of Newton Raphson uh, which was 2. So uh, this iterative method converts slowly as compared to Newton-Raphson method. So